KTR, the minister from Telangana government, trying to blame BJP government and Modi ji to cover up their failures. As far as this Bayaram steel plant is concerned, as per the Andhra Pradesh Reorganization Act, the Ministry of Steels from Government of India repeatedly appealing the state government to look into the establishment of steel plant at Bayaram and provide necessary information and documentation and required incentives or land, everything. But even after almost nine years have passed, the Telangana government did not bother to respond positively. Replying to an RTI query, the Ministry of Steel has said that though the centre has urged the Telangana government to take decisions on land allotment, incentives, tax connections and railway linkage, the state did not take any decision in the last few years till date. The steel ministry wrote repeatedly more than six letters urging the state government to finalize the land and others pertaining to the establishment of steel plant. However, there is no response from the Telangana government. And the ministry appointed a MECON, a public sector undertaking to prepare the detailed project report for the Bayaram steel factory. The ministry asked the state government to identify land for the factory for preparing the DPR. Interestingly, in one of the meetings convened by the steel ministry, the Telugu Desham state government representative informed the center that Telangana was examining a parcel of land in Mahibunar close to its border with Karnataka. Though the Telugu, Telangana state officials informed the center in 2019 that the land would be finalized soon, there has been no action till date. The ministry even said that they did not receive any letter from even Telangana Chief Minister Mr. K. Chandrasekhar Rao. So you can imagine how concerned this government and this CM is for establishing a Bayaram steel plant. In spite of Government of India repeatedly writing letters. Based on various reports, the Minister of State Steel at one point of time decided to enhance the capacity of the sponge iron factory located at Palwancha and operated by NMDC up to 1.5 tons per annum. Now, oh, I really surprised to know KTR has stooped down to that level linking this Bayaram Vizak steel plant and iron ore of Bailadilla to Adani and Pradani to cover up their failures. Now they have been totally now involved in the corrupt now allegations. Now to divert the minds of the Telangana public, they are trying to bring in this Vishaka steel platinum and also this iron ore Bailadilla reserves wherein it seems they, he says that the government has allotted iron ore to uh, uh, Mr. Adani, which is totally a false because that Bailadilla iron ore project is under the control of NMDC. Now the government Telangana has got full rights to have the reserve for iron ore, but so far the government has done nothing for it. But other side, the AP government has already obtained iron ore lease from Obulapuram. Now a Japanese factory, Japanese company has come forward to establish, to come forward to take that uh, iron ore on lease and Jindal has come forward to establish a plant in Kadapa. But whereas in Bayaram, it is totally due to the failure of this Telangana government and KCR, that Bayaram steel plant, that uh, government of India could not able to take any decision. Now the people of Telangana should now realize how KTR and KCR trying to uh, divert the public and trying to spread falsehood news to the Telangana people. This is how the Telangana government is functioning. Now Telangana people should now realize and teach them a proper fitting lesson because it is totally deep rooted involved in all corrupt practices. It is a family rule. People are vexed and fed up and moreover the people from TRS and BRS 
Now they are questioning their leadership. Now to divert the attention of the Telangana people, they have brought this Bayaram Vaisak uh, steel episode into the picture and connecting to Adani. So Telangana people, I appeal to realize what this government is trying to mislead the people of Telangana.